So the neighbor brought this gearbox over, and what happened is these holes got wobbled out. Um, so what we're going to do is take some nickel rod, fill them back in, and then clean it up. And then we'll take the milling machine and re-bore the hole. The, the kind of nice thing here is you got these mounting bolts. So what I'm going to do to help me for simplicity of setup to make sure that when I travel from boring that hole to doing that hole is I travel in a straight line. So putting this on the mill machine, what I'm going to do is the old bolts, this is one of the old bolts that go in there. And uh, the slot, so I'm going to machine this bolt flat to fit in this slot of the table. The bolt head itself is at about, is about uh, 780 roughly across, and the table is about 715. So we got to take a roughly 30 thousandths off of each side to narrow him up to fit in that slot and be centered. And then we'll pull the vise off, clean the table, and weld that guy up and then flop him up here. And then once, so, so that we'll find, that will help us get set. So once we find our center line this way, then it stays so we can travel from there to there. Then it's just a matter of just getting set up to find the center of this hole and to find the center each way after welding it up. So we'll take a couple reference point measurements um, to see where we're at and, and uh, kind of go from there. All right, so we made just a, a rough pass there and uh, we ended up touching it a little bit. We might remeasure it and see that we've already moved 15 thousandths in on our first pass. We've gained 15 thousandths. So we come down here, we were at zero right here, and then we just back up 15 thousandths. Uh, we're gonna stay a few thousand shy of the finish line, just there's flex and movement. You know, that bolt in the nut isn't the most rigid, so we're, we're just gonna move that 15 thousandths and then take a, a couple passes on the same thing and, and clean it up, and then we'll, uh, and then we'll do the other side. There you go. It just, just fits. And that's okay because some of the spots here gets a little snug. And so, yeah, perfect, perfect. There you go. Whoop.
Well, it fits. There's just a couple thousands clearance. Maybe 10 at the most. Nice, nice. Turned out really well. These cows are gonna, they're always so happy when they get a silage bale. The steers and heifer calves, they don't get that excited about it, but the cows, they, it's about the same as putting a pail of corn out there. Zach, he does a good job on the gate. He gets a little overzealous sometimes. The cows, the cows and the heifers, they they won't take it. They'll charge them and they'll run them right out of the pasture. But these calves, they they put up with them.